is what's going to be in the Volkswagen Beetle. <laughs> so that's the battery that goes in the front, that's the battery that goes in the back, and that there is the motor. Anyway, we're going to get it running. We're going to wire it up and we're going to get it going. Martin's here to keep an eye on me, because everything's disconnected, but it's to save me blowing Wales off the map, because that could be easily done. 95% of British mechanics aren't qualified to work on EVs. Guy is one of them. So the circuit is checked to see if it is live before he's allowed to touch anything. Yeah. yeah, no, nothing. Zero point nothing zero, zero. It's perfectly safe. Making one of the world's most sophisticated electric motors work is little different to wiring a plug. That's it. Perfect. Thick latex gloves will insulate Guy against electrocution while he inserts the three yeah, connectors yeah. that will make the system live. That way. Other way. That way. That's it. Perfect. Hold on. But we are now live, so we've got 400 volts on here. Once the control box is connected, Perfect. the workbench Tesla is ready yep. to be driven. So ignition on, yep. press the start button. Should Shall I leave the gloves on? Yes, please. Right, are we going to go for it? You ready? There we go. So give it some more. Go right the way up if you want. So I'm going to jump off the bench. No. Get out. That's it. Perfect. Go again. You can go again. 600 horsepower is being generated by 500 kilos of batteries and the most basic of wiring. Perfect. Instant enough. What sort of faff would we have had to do if we wanted to get that same horsepower out of an internal combustion engine? Far simpler, isn't it? In fact, electric motors are so simple that you can build one in a van. You ready? You ready? All you need are paper clips and a fundamental of physics. Right, you saw me wind the coil up, and what we're going to do here, we're going to put an electrical current through that, and you create a magnetic field. As simple as that. The magnetic field that we've created in this coil gets attracted to that magnet there, and then the other side of the coil will be repelled. So it'll attract, repel, attract, repel, which creates rotational motion, which turns a motor, which can move your car. Sort of as simple as that. I think that might be a go with you now. Come on. All that's left to do is connect a battery to the circuit. Hold your breath, boys. Look at that. Look at that. Attract, repel, attract, repel. Home brewed motor. <laughs> 